Hello, and welcome to the Strange High House, uh, the first of three HP Lovecraft games. Uh, we'll look at the credits last. Okay, volume. I'll put a half, I guess. Mouse sensitivity. Doesn't affect this screen, so I, I'll put it here, I guess. I don't know. Okay. The year is 1921. I have responded to a distraught telegraph. Yeah, telegraph concerning the strange disappearances. The strange disappearance of my uncle, a decently renowned philosopher by the name of Thomas... Olvi, Olvery, by name of Thomas Olvery, I guess. I don't know. He had taken a liking to the coastal village of Kingsport. Oh, it's another Kingsport. Is this going to be the same one as, um, is this, is this one based on the same story as, um, Terrible Old Man? Maybe. Uh, to the coastal village of Kingsport and its rather curious surroundings north of archaic Keensport, the crags climb lofty and curious terrace and curious terrace on terrace till the northmost hangs in the sky like a oh my god uh like a like a fire like a fiery fro like a like a very frozen by a something frozen wind cloud, alone it is a bleak point jutting in limitless space. Upon this cliff stands a singular ancient house. Inventory. All right, back to menu. All right, no, continue. Oh. Oh. Oh, why is it running like a potato? Oh dear god, it's running like a potato. This is very high up. Or I guess the ocean is right. Like, you can see kind of the ocean line in the distance, so... I guess while it is still... Yeah, there is the ocean. While it is a oh, decrepit place. Is this where Uncle Thomas has gone? Uh, too? He never used to be the adventurous type. Whatever made him come up here must be, must really have mesmerized him. Yeah, this is real, real tall. What the hell? I can't get across. I don't dare jump this chasm. I have to search for a way to cross. Hmm. Can I cut down the tree? Or do I climb the tree and then go over it? An old tree hanging over the cliffside. Cool, can I climb it? Can I climb it? Can I climb it? No? No? Okay. Maybe, maybe I chop it down. Eh. Or maybe it's like, it's like a, a side path or something? No, it's, it's not a side path. Oh, um, is that a broken bridge or is that like a wooden plank that I can go over and down on like, you know, walketh around it? I don't know. Words, cool words. At least five words. No, that's not. Well. Yeah, okay, okay. I still think the tree. I still think the tree is the method. I just can't figure out how to climb the tree. Oh dear. Okay, uh, uh, I'll cut to when I find the answer. That. Oh, planks. Thanks. Yo, these should help. Yes. Mm, careful now. Sprint. Even worse than I thought. 
How very odd that it is still standing. Warm ridden as it is. What the fuck is this? Oh, it's a fish god totem thing. It's a fish priest. An occult idol. Rather ancient from the looks of it. The cult of Dagon, if I remember correctly. Thank you for my childhood. <laughs> Thank you for my childhood nightmares, Uncle Thomas. Bedtime stories indeed. Yeah, there's stories to tell in the dark. And they're horrify you to the core. Is this a cane? You're telling me to look at it, but you're not giving me any prompts for text or anything. So I'm going to assume it's nothing. I'm going to assume it's useless and I'm never going to have to take a peek at that again. Also, why is the brightness abysmal? Barred and tightly sealed. I need to find another way in. Okay. Could I bash it down? No. Okay. And I'll go around the back of the house then. Or not. I'll go through the window. The boards on this window are loose. I need something to pry them open with. Uh, this nifty difty thing right here, probably. The boards on this window are loose. The boards? Cool. Cool. Can I... I grabbed the thing. Can I do the thing now? No? Okay. Is there like an invent? What is that? Oh, I dug it up. I see. Unexpected. But it will certainly be of use. I'm assuming it's a Krober. I don't like that noise. Well, that's a... You got any light? On the table is a lamp. Is a lighted lamp. Someone must be here. Interesting. Alluring scribes. Provo uh, provocative drawings. Okay, anything to say about this one? Curious. Okay, that one you had nothing to say about. What about these guys? Strange notes. Blasphemic and cryptic writings. Okay, blasphemic to what, though? There's several different religions. A bunch stack of dirty utensils. I wager the big portrait shows the shack's owner. What narcissism to hang it up in a place like this. Uncle Thomas surely must have loved the idea as we as well. Dear Crapper as is everything else. I would love to be able to see a key that's barely seen use. You know, it's barely seen. Period. Goodness gracious. I'm a jump. Okay, I can't jump. Uh, but considering how the ocean is like in a concentric circle around this point, I expect I am going to be jumping in there sometime. Okay, that's not the table. Locked. But there's no keyhole to be seen anywhere. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Oh, this bears little resemblance to anything I have encountered before. No hole, just a dense and cryptic lines in the construction surface. Can you describe the lines to me? Okay. Never mind. It swings in an oddly rhythmic motion. Mesmerizing. My man over here is complimenting his own work. Okay. 
the hell am I looking at over here? Another broken chair. Bro, I can't see anything. I am bewildered. It cannot be. Uncle Thomas was cooking? It smells like an, uh, it smells like the awful rations overseas, but burnt to a crisp. Hey, that's not nice. The man's face is scratched out. The portrait has changed. It cannot be. This goes beyond simple phantasm. There's something else at work here. I don't know, it could just be someone else. You jumped... You, uh, you jumped to this conclusion very quickly. That it was the work. Oh, come... Uh, come on. There's a lot of blood on the floor. A fresh pattern of blood, different from the others. This fight was lost. There's more blood stains on the floor? What? I can't see... Shit! What is this? It's a body. I see. Well, yeah, hey, you know what, Skelly? Skelly, my boy. Curious thing. Was it worth its price, I wonder? Hold on. Have I not seen this before? Somewhere? You have. On the portrait and on that imp in indent up there. Also, Skelly, thank you for your offering. Um, since you're obviously not going to be put into good use, I will do it in your stead. Bloody hell. Okay, well, that's all. Alright, cool. The skeleton obviously won't find any use for it, but I will. Yeah. Well, this looks more satanic than Cthulhu-esque. Oh, that's Cthulhu. That's a Cthulhu-esque thing. Actually, whose symbol is that? Is that Cthulhu's symbol? I don't think so. Man, it's been a while since I've looked at their symbols. I want to see if I can um, find the yellow sign. Like, how many different deities did they add? At least five, right? That's not it. That's not the yellow sign. That's not it either. Uh. Okay, whatever. Yog Sothoth, known as the Gate. Yep. Yog Sothoth is the Gate. One and all, all in one, the key and the gate. Ah, Shabnigaras. I'm glad it just tells me. It's impossible to, de to decipher. Okay, fair enough. So we got, um, the black goat. Okay. Cool. We got the black goat. We got the, the gate and the key. Engross, engrossing thoughts. The work of insanity. Oh no. Sacrilegious manuscripts. Again, sacrilegious to what? Nonsensical. Is it sacrilegious to life itself? But then again, that's just a matter of opinion. Profane words. Insane objective. Well, what is the objective? Can you tell me? On the table is a lighted lamp. Someone must be here. Ill intention. Okay, okay. Let's look at this picture. I can't look at it. Okay, never mind. Ah, Cthulhu is presumed to be the center of the old ones. He connects the... know if that's true I, I don't um I don't know if that's true what in God's name what in God's name can I light the candles can I finish the seance or summoning or I don't know what's happening here but can I can I do it yog sothoth interesting 
Okay, so let's see. This is a puzzle. I'm bad at puzzles. Oh, you're lit. Oh. Okay. I see. Good, good. Nope, not good. Okay. Okay. The Oxythoth. The goat. Is it uh, probably not Cthulhu? Well, it might be Cthulhu. Oh? Oh? Okay, and then the last one is this guy over here? No. I said words there, not words that I'm going to attempt to pronounce, but I said words when I earlier I said it was indecipherable. Okay. Now what? I found it. It was in the fucking. I just needed to open something. Needed to open the closet. Oh my god. So you found your way? Welcome to Magnificent Unfathomable Infinity. Oh shit. Uh, what in God's name shall this uh, delirious phantasm, the other one is here as well. Like him you have opened the veiled gate atop the peak. We welcome you. Arthur, listen not to their treacherous ramblings. The fiends are not what they claim to be. I don't know. Uncle, at last I found you. Uh, your uncle just told you to run away. Be gone from this place. S uh, sooner better than later, as you are in hideous danger. Do not let yourself be spirited away in a fit of utter madness like I was. No, you're not going to be able to leave this easily. I mean... I'm kind of okay with Stan, man. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of okay with Stan. I mean, you know what? I'll I'll I'll, I'll take the ending where I jump into the uh, giant. Um... Wait, can I just screw up the summoning? No, I don't have that option anymore. Oh no, it's locked. Yeah, okay. I'm just gonna yeah yeah fuck it. Let's go. Oh, uh huh? What? The trenches? How? You possess knowledge. You possess experience. Utter alien to us. You are different. You are molded by conflict. You witness a fraction of what it is to be on these strange fields of mud and blood and excrement and death that hound your darkest dreams still. I thought this was going to be a three scary games, guys. This is not a three scary games. This is its own video. What on earth? Oh, ascend. What you need to do is tread on the path of enlightenment you see winding before you. We shall guide you. Arthur, please, I beg of you, listen to me. You will not be dead, but worse, gone. Nothing of you will be left. The state of existence is horrible behind human conception. Well, you say nothing will be the choice is yours, traveler. A cinder stay behind in your rotting mortal body. Well, oh, a cinder escape. Is there a third option? Is, is there a third option up here? Can I do the summon? No, I can't. Okay. Kill. Cool. Okay. Um, I'll just do both. Um, here, I'll do the one that, um, uh, the the edgelord isekai lover of me wants to do which is the ascend and and then i'll do the one that i would actually pick which is the escape you know yeah i would like to ascend please you've chosen well thank you no 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 arthur no no what will become of him now and of me eh. he has made his choice he has chosen to stay he chose pitiful mortality and ignorance. 
he will eventually be forgotten. You chose enlightenment. You chose to accept the inescapable truth, the infinite, voracious void that awaits all. Yet you did not then. You did not turn away in fear, but you passed through the veil. You are like us. None of us. Um, none of none of something to our limited exist. Oh, none of us clinged to our limited existences. Yet all of us uh left all of all of us behind as you will you eventually come now come along uh the path and tell us show us share with us we are what you will be and we will be what you are come traveler all righty all right i'm gonna do that again except i'll get the escape ending right, come on Yemen? Yeah, Thank you. I'm escaping. Bye bye. Alright, this is where I picked the escape ending. Ascend. Destroy sun. Run along now, away from these whispering devils. Run and don't run back until you can see the mist no longer. Uh, no, I don't think it's that good of a choice, actually. I have left a strange high house in the mist behind, and with it, whatever remains of my uncle Thomas something. All very, I said last time. Too many terrible wonders are hidden in that damnable place. They have driven him and oh fuck. Even now, uh, the voice continued to echo within my mind and will surely continue to do so for a while longer. However, I am not what they want me to be. I am my own man, just like my uncle. And in his spirit, I shall preserve my individuality. All right. Alright, we're good. We done. Whoa, credits. That was good. Oh yeah, I like that. I think this is this was this the one that was oh, get out. Not even exit. Just get out. Leave. Run. Okay, I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah. That was all I can I, I liked it a lot. Um I thought I was gonna make a part of a three scary games, but that took me thirty minutes. Even with editing, I think it'll go down to like 22 or something. So I'm just keep this as a solo game. But yeah, that wait, was this made by a family? No, no, it wasn't. Okay. For some reason, I took the commas in between um, the names as like first name, comma, last name. But no, that's just that's just two different people. Okay, that makes more sense. Yeah, no, uh, I enjoyed playing it. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching it. And, uh, yeah, I, I'll i be seeing you in the next one then. Um, yeah, it's just enjoyable. We'll, we'll see what else the other Lovecraft games have in store for me. But I'm happy with this. <laughs> see ya.